I was scrolling through TikTok one day when I found a person playing a Pokemon fan game where you could fuse two Pokemon. And I did what any other bored Pokemon player would do. I downloaded it, I started playing it, and it is amazing. Enjoy! And by the way, if you like the video, subscribe please. That Pidgeot Blaziken looks amazing. And is that Steelix scared? This is gonna be cool. Let's start this new game. You can change your age? Oh, you can only be 17. I'm fine with that. 17, you can't change your city, that sucks. Okay, we'll do normal di difficulty. I don't want it to be too hard. Game type, what, what does that mean? All the fusions used by trainers are flipped. So if a trainer normally has Pikachu, Bulbasaur, you'll have a Bulbasaur, oh, that's so cool. Okay, we're gonna go with normal because this is my first time playing. Auto save, yes, we can have on. I'm fine with that. Oh, okay. Music's a bit of a bust for this. But hey, everything else? Y'all are doing good on. Silfco is now proud to announce the new product that will revolutionize Pokemon battling. Introducing DNA Splicers. This revolutionary new device extracts the DNA of two Pokemon and combines them to create an entirely new species. Select any two Pokemon, use your DNA splicers on them, and just watch the magic happen before your eyes. We're gonna go with Squirtle. Wait, did you? Can you turn them around? Oh no, they're doing it themselves. Yeah, we're just gonna go with Squirtle. Charizard. He got both starters. He got that abomination. There we go. Look, you may have had the fusions blue, but you know I got the skill. All right. Are you a trainer? What are you doing here? You a trainer too? Oh. Oh. I'm not used to there being trainers on this route. What? Last Mimi. Well, the regular ass Pidgey, look at that. I wish there was this. Oh my god! There's wild fusions. Rat gay. Rat G. Rat, rat G. Oh my god, no. Uh, are you serious? Can we, uh. Can we just pretend like that didn't happen? I'm Professor Oak's boy. Oh, thank you. Okay. Thank you for just giving them to me. <laughs> I thought this would be something Professor Oak did, but hey. I'll take it from the random guy at the mall. That's also good. 175,000. <laughs> and putting all 1,000 in Scarlet and Violet was too much. I want to do Squirtle Tangle if I can find it. Yeah, we'll, ca we'll catch a Ratchy. Alright, we'll have we'll just have these two, these two fusions. Number 6,739. And... What if I was to use these DNA splicers on y'all? Yeah, I'm gonna just unfuse them. And they're back to these guys. Oh, they're all, uh, they're a one-use item. Well, that was kind of a waste then, wasn't it? So many names are too close to Orgy, and I don't like it. Level seven, what the fuck is up with these trainers? I mean, it's dead, but still. Oh, he gave me a Pokeball! Okay, battling people may be something I want to do then, if they're going to give me cool items. Show me... Hoot hoot, okay. DNA Slicer! Boom, with you! Get a water flying... Oh, you get the pick? I like this shape better. I like this shape a lot better, we're going to see. <laughs> Hoodle! What else is on this route? Oh, Nidoran. That probably would have been cooler. Let's let's catch Nidoran, and if we have a Mankey, I wanna I wanna fuse them together. Or should I find a Pikachu? Ooh, we could go to the forest and find a Pikachu to mix with him. A rat pie. <laughs> Ew, this does not sound like something I would want to eat. Yeah. Nido G. That's kind of cool looking, actually. That's really cool looking. Too bad it sucks. I thought its name was Charizard Will. How many Pokemon is it gonna take to find Pikachu? Not a Weedle either. Although a Caterpie Weedle would be a, an abomination. <laughs> yeah, that, you know, it actually... <laughs> that looks fun. That actually looks better than I thought. You know what? We're just gonna tackle if it lives. We'll keep it. Okay. Weepy. We'll keep Weepy on the team. We'll keep Weepy on the team for now. Weepy has an extremely acute sense of smell. It releases a terribly strong odor from its antenna, so it's just gonna sit there and smell its bad self the whole time? This poor, poor monster. Pichu will work perfectly fine for this. I'm just gonna throw a ball. Pichu and Nidoran. Oh, God. Did we go with the cursed one? Let's go with the cursed one. This one might look good, though. <laughs> oh, no. 
P-Ran. It is still inept at retaining electricity. Even the slightest sound does not escape this Pokemon's notice. The poison mouse Pokemon. <laughs> the sprite for this. I need to save. This, this game's a gym. This game's just one big gym. Oh my god, it's Pidgeyu! I want it! It's got the wrong sprites! Regular Pidgey has Pidgey and Nidoran sprites on it. Is it in Caterbat? It's a Caterpie Zubat? Oh my god! That's kind of dope! I, I like that. Well, not necessarily this one. Ooh, oh god! You know what? I'm glad we got Weepy, not Caterdle. Caterdle looks a little messed up. Okay, so it is evolving. Oh, it is doing a double evolution, I think. <laughs> no, it's it turned into a wee pod. <laughs> no, are we gonna do? We're gonna have to uh, level it up again, I think, to get it into a cacapod. No, I didn't think I'd sneak past you. I literally walked up to you. The Geo ran. Oh my goodness! What do you got? <laughs> a GOP, a sand dude. <laughs> oh my god, it's a sand dude. Oh my god, it's a sand dude. Okay, what are we- we're getting a cacopod? Cacopod. It looks like a condom. Oh my god. Alright Brock, let's see what you got. I might not win, but I could damn sure have some fun seeing your Pokemon. You have to enter Pokemon? I only do two? Oh shoot. That's so dope. Okay, that adds some good challenge to the game. We got GOG. Water gun! I'll just let it rock polish. Rock tomb. Oh my god, no! We might lose. Oh my god! Don't kill. Oh no! Oh! You're far flying, it won't hit you! Let's go. Let's go! Oh my god, Brock was easy. We got the boulder batch. With rock tomb, hell yeah. Saying the premium wonder trade ticket. That sounds cool. 